folks welcome to alien addict um this is uh, my brand new channel name i was all this 51 for past subscribers that i have that you will all know who i am still all this 51 by name uh, but the channel's now alien addict so yeah um what i'll be doing with the channel is i will generally look for decent stuff that's out there and i'll put it up on the channel might even go scouting out find my own stuff I'm, lo I'm looking at getting one of them you know them gopros and like i might go venturing out with it um but i'm gonna do um some debunks debunks with mates might interview randomers in the streets um some of my friends are the best people to talk to about ufos because they just don't have a clue and they don't not not many of them believe in it so it's kind of like funny to talk to them about it um, anyway, without further ado, um, I'm going to uh, show you um, Secure Team's latest video. Another photograph that I want to show you guys sent to me from Andrew in Tulsa, Oklahoma, who had snapped some pictures of uh, something, an object, moving through the sky pretty far in the distance, he said in his email, and he said it just seemed to sit there. He said that he first noticed it as he was driving on the highway and he got on the exit ramp and stopped in order to snap some pictures. Now, some people said hot air balloon, but he wasn't so sure about that. Here's probably the best shot where the object is not being obstructed by the power line. And we'll go ahead and zoom in here. And uh, I'm not so sure that that's a hot air balloon. I mean, it, it almost looks like an upside down hot air balloon where we have this uh, teardrop shape here and I don't see a basket hanging from it or anything like that. So if it is a hot air balloon, it's a very strange one. So definitely wanted to show you guys uh, the source in Tulsa wanted to get our input. I haven't frozen, sorry. I'm just, uh, I just realized I need to kind of like learn how to do these kind of edited videos a bit more but um yeah whatever um so um tyler's been getting his source to send him um pigeons or well maybe not a pigeon it could be any type of bird i don't know i'm not really up on birds but i'm sure somebody may recognize what that might be um bird wise um i don't think it's a ufo or a hot air balloon i think it's a um pigeon you know one of them that's out there shitting on my car um yeah so this is the type of thing I might be doing if I get bored. I, I, I didn't know what to do tonight. I was like, what, what do I put out? And I'm like, I kind of think it's, like, it's a guilty pleasure. Uh, I'll, every so often I will look at secure team shit and um, I'll sit there and I'll scratch my head a little bit like that. And I'll go like that. I'll go like that. Why does he fake this? Is it just a pigeon? Hot air balloon? A big sausage in the sky? don't know um but yeah i just thought i've got to kind of that's that is it just me or is that definitely like a little you know pigeon it's probably not a pigeon i mean do, do you get pigeons in the the u.s you get them over here seagulls as well um but yeah um just thought i'd pop that out for you and let you know that I've changed my channel. Oh, by the way, crazy. Yeah, I was called Arvis51. The last video that I put out where I said the name of my new channel, Alien Addict, I just realised that was my 51st video. Strange, strange things. Yeah, anyway, good night, God bless. Mind the bugs don't bite and... Uh, Get subscribing to uh, Alien Addict. Yeah. Good night. Can't remember how to end this video.
It's like starting back at square one. There you go.